guys welcome back to the channel uh got back at this pond here for this episode of monster hunt mondays this pond is almost never fished i don't know if you can tell but every time i'm out here no one else is um reason behind it i'm not supposed to be fishing here so hopefully there's some big bass out there i've caught a, a couple three pounders almost out of here so see if we can get on something guys i'm gonna get set up and uh, we'll get to it. All right, guys. So I'm starting off with the uh, the bully blade by Lunker Hunt here. It's a little black and blue for the the early bite. There's definitely something out here. Change it up a little bit here. Let me throw something here on the top. See if I can get something on a little top water bite. All right, guys, going with this is a, a Booyah Buzz Bait. I don't remember the color name. I got a uh, Green Gizzard Shad. Saucy swimmer on it. Might be a little too windy for top water out here, but we're gonna give it a go anyways. This thing does move a lot of water around, so. Yeah, a bass, large mouth, yeah. You do that, not a, not a huge one there, but I'll zoom out for you here. Not a huge fish, but still a good one. Get it back in the water. All right. And that was on that buzz bait. He hit it pretty hard. So, trick I've learned with the buzz bait is just bring it slow. Don't speed it up. Don't. Dang, I thought something else already hit it. So, I'm just steady reel, nice and slow. If it gets too crazy, the blade will start going really fast. And another one hit right on the edge of the grass. Oh, this one's a little bigger, guys. <laughs> Might have to get a weight on this guy. So this guy's a little bit bigger, a little bit chunkier. Let's get a weight on him.
just under two pounds. I don't know if you guys can see that. Just under two pounds. So not a bad fish. I'm telling you, there's bigger ones out here. All right, that was a big boy. All right, guys, we'll come back to that that buzz bait. Um, right now, I'm throwing a weightless bandito bug, the black and blue or a watermelon. It's called Okeechobee crawls. The color. That one. They are hitting this morning. So, number three already, guys. Been out here for maybe 30 minutes. So. That's a good one. Get your butt back in there. Alright. And here's that Okeechobee Crawl Bandito Bug. So super heavy blue on one side. And then uh, the watermelon or green pumpkin on the other side. He tore this one up. So we're going to switch it up to something else here. Alright guys, so we're back here on the other side. Uh, so we were fishing all the way down there at the end, and now we are fishing on this side. They got some grass over here. I'm going to be throwing, of course, the buzz bait on top of this water. And then um, this, this is a saw crawl by 10,000 fish. Uh, the link for all of the stuff that I'm using today down in the description below if you want to check it out. And this crawl, I'm also running weightless just like I was doing the bandito bug. And I'm just letting this thing sink and just kind of subtly raising it up and letting it sink the claws on this thing have amazing action so this should catch me something over here they like crawls out here Ooh, something hit it when i was swimming it through the water i saw him come out of he came out of this grass right here and hit it thing through i mean they definitely like it, I'm gonna let it sink a little bit. And then I'm just gonna swim it. There's one. There's another one. Oh, you're a big boy too. Let's see. So, that's not a bad one, guys. Let's get a weight on him. One eleven. So 
not too bad of a bass there. Let's see if I can get him in the water somewhat gently today. Another good size bass. Another good one. He's short, but he's kind of chunky. That was on the, uh, the old monster worm. I saw him hit it and just start running with it. Zero this thing out about one one twelve. Okay, stop moving so I can get it off here. Come on, work with me. All right. So, just on the, the old monster here. A little one. Well, maybe not so little. Definitely little as of the day, I think. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Is that the smallest one of the day? He hit it like right on the top. I didn't even know that's where my worm was. All right, guys, just going with, change up the worm a little bit. Going with the little yum dinger here in the watermelon red. Did put a 1 16th ounce weight on it so I can get out a little closer to these grass lines here. Did I already get one on the fall? Oh yeah. Good one too. This is a good one, guys. On the fall. Damn, he got wrapped up in grass. Look at this, guys. Did he shake me off in the grass? Yep, he did. That was a fish who shook me off into the grass. And I just pulled up. I think the biggest thing of grass I've ever I've ever caught. Dang, I would have loved to see that fish. Yeah. All right, guys, that is it for me today. Going to go home. Sun's out. Forgot my sunglasses at home. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed catching these fish today. One of the better days of the summer. And uh, still got some monsters to hunt out there. Guys, if you liked the video, thumbs up, subscribe, drop me a comment. Let me know what you thought. And, guys, I'll see you on the next one.